Hello and welcome to another Four Realms of Chaos video. This week we have a review on a spray booth. So this is a generic hobby spray booth you can buy. The only thing it says it's spray booth, LED light, hobby tool, very, very basic. Um, I got this on eBay and I'll leave a link in the description for you guys for the model I bought. It was only 150 bucks Canadian. So this is the box it came with and I'm gonna show you guys what is inside. Okay, so here's a look at the front of the spray booth. As you can see, it's actually pretty big. Um, right here is an Imperial Knight, uh, which is a really large 40K model. And there is a Plague Marine. So yeah, you got lots of space to work with. You can like lay uh, the models you finish just inside here. And also it came with a rotating disc, which has been pretty useful. Um, and it's just also removable. So you can just take this out and yeah. So it also has lights and I'm gonna show you guys uh, how it looks like when it turns on, which is just this button at the back. So it's pretty loud, I don't know. Uh, they say quiet, but I wouldn't say this is quiet. Um, okay, I'm just gonna turn it off. Okay, so let me just t give you guys a 360 view. Um, the cord isn't super long, so it's about like four or five feet. And yeah, like here's the back. It usually comes with this huge tube set right here. Um, this can probably uh, roll out to, I think it's like 12 feet. Uh, it's like huge. And it has one of these vents here that you can just put outside your your window. Uh, but in here, we don't have an access to open window, so I put a just regular um, paper towel at the back, and it basically has two filter sheets already. So back here, we're just gonna take a look and see if anything actually went through. And yeah, so after airbrushing for, I don't know, a couple weeks with this, like, it's just very lightly through here, so that's, uh, shows the filter pads are doing a good job. So let's look at some more stuff back here. Basically very simple. On and off button. And just the power plug here. And yeah, it's also very uh, storageable. You can pull all these things apart and it can compact into like uh, probably this size right here. Just everything folds up. So yeah, if you have any other like irritants, like super glue or uh, like plastic glue or something like not too strong. This really takes out the fumes. Okay, so now I'm gonna show you guys a clip of the airbrush booth in action. So here we are airbrushing the Air Brass Scorpion. It's a Warhammer 40K Forge World model. So yeah, just getting the base coat on. And that's about as loud as it gets. So for 150 bucks, you can't really go wrong. This thing actually works really well and has tons of uses. So that brings us to the end of the video. If you guys liked it, please subscribe and stick around. We'll see you guys later. Rock on.